So, hey guys, I'm going to show you how to add an image and actually two images into iMovie. So, get your file that you want, drag it down, and what I want you to do is go and find an image, any image you want, save it, and import it into iMovie. Once you have the image, I want you to double click on the actual image that you've imported and go to the crop section and press crop. Crop down the image if you want to, if you need to, and then press um, the tick on the OK. Once you're ready, just drag it, drag that image anywhere on the timeline where you want it. So once you've dragged the image down onto the timeline, you will notice that the image now takes over the full video and the video is gone. What I want you to do is go to the video overlay layer or section and then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to press on you'll see the drop down menu and you want to go to picture in picture and so when you press this what will happen is that it will now be on top of your video okay now you get to move it around and you do as you please with the image you also have options of like dissolving, zooming, swapping the image, you know, you play with the borders, shadowing, colour. Um, you also can add a time to these effects. So if you see, for example, it's going to dissolve in. If you can see what I'm going to do now, I'm going to go and see change the time to zero because I don't want any kind of transition. I just want it to appear straight onto the page. So what I've done now is I've dragged uh, another layer of the image and I'm going to just add it in at a different point of the timeline and um, just so that you can see that we can add two different images in the same video. You know, you can change the colour again and do as you please with the image that you've added. Or you can even add a new one. So as you can see, I've now added two different images back to back. Now you might be thinking, how do I add two images in at the same time in the video? Well, you're going to have to save this, this video and upload it again. You'll then have to upload the new video that you've saved with the, um, you know, with your images, with the images that you've added in. Once you do that, just check that you do have the right video now and then delete the old video or the old version from the timeline. Uh, because you'll no longer need that so you're play you're basically replacing the two videos and you're deleting the old one well, so i know i'm using the same image again and again but you can always use different images i'm just pretty much showing you that it can be done where you have two images at the same time um you know simultaneously so here i am just changing the color of the rectangle and showing you that they both appear at the same time I know it's a bit annoying having to import and export the video again, but that's how to do it and I hope in some way I have helped you with this tutorial.